It's the same beacon and it's the same no crafting, you don't bro. Die. Wait, scissors, where are you landing? I'm Up top? Okay, I'm landing in the back. I'm landing in the back. I'm landing in the back. Huh? You think guys are gonna kill me? No. Leave. Well, that's our beacon. I'm leaving. Farm boys are in here, right? We told them yesterday that that's our beacon. I don't know why this thing is kind of, kind of weird. They're like uh, hard we pushing. Well, we can just back up. Wait, they're pushing us? Yep. I'm, I'm gonna heal. I'm gonna okay. heal. I can't hell glitch that really. Nah, they're not really pushing that. Did he gonna... go back? He was stimming after him. I think they thought he was a solo. He's getting shot at. He's getting shot at. Yeah, he's pushing. He's pushing. Shoot up. Shoot up. Haha, <laughs> dumbass. He's crashing. He's crashing. No. Nice. Wait, this is a duo. This is a duo. All right, I have to climb back up. I have to climb oh, back right up. Here. He jumped off. He's finished by E-S-S-T. E e e e e what E-S-S-T is. I don't know who this team is. They're running up. I'm blue. 50 blue, blue. on blue. One's, one's, at, one's right here on my ping. Okay. I'm gonna be watching this guy. He's on white. He's on white. Okay, man. We're on white blue then. He's like... They're like kind of old. Yeah, anything. They're holding. Yeah. I'm gonna run inside. Uh, you have Cossicle here. I mean, you can call Cossicle inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need my hit. They're falling back again. I'm pushing okay, up. Moving up, moving up. I'm Gibby's on, on the left. One's the left, Gibby's on the left. They both, they both back, they both back. Crack, 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 crack. I'm getting on the truck. I'm on top of Davis. Careful, don't take too much damage here. He's pushing you, he's pushing you. I know, I Cossicle did. Dead. Nice, nice. I'm over here on us, Mason. They're back up. Crack, give me crack, give me crack, give me crack, I'm pushing up, I'm pushing up. Yeah, perfectly timed bubble as well. As soon as that last one expires, their bubble goes down, giving them full advantage over that, allowing them to completely control the situation. They push in and they do it pretty tactically, and they are going to wipe that, making easy work of Phoenix Blight and crew, and that's going to now be 14 squads left in the game. We're safe on this What are they doing? They're porting. We're safe on, this, we're safe on these uh, crates as well. This She's like, like trying to climb. Power. She's trolling. I'm taking about a bit. Yeah, depending on where the end zone is, it really can be even important much earlier in the game and not surprising to see teams just trading out that location and fighting desperately over it. Take a look at Knights. Looks like a Skyward died. Oh, so much up. damage. Yeah, oh, my God. Get shot on. Uh, joined, and it's actually going to be Bronzy falling right away. Yeah. We thought the Dome Shield was going to allow the Skyward Dive go up, but actually gets canceled right away on the Nox. So they are in all sorts of trouble down low. Yeah, this is messy. This is really messy for Knights at the moment. And, uh, yep, yeah, dip on your chip. Well, you Keeping him alive for now. Doesn't look good. Elevate should win this game. Uh, Elevate should win this game. The team on top have to drop down. That's going to engage two brains, one controller. At least some damage will be done. It's a case of just closing that gap and being the third party here for Elevate. The Sentinel in the hands. Maybe not the gun that you want in end game, but it certainly can do some damage on the way down. Defensive above. And I tell you what, I'd stand corrected because that is really going to mix things up. And now an opportunity for two brains, one controller, maybe to get involved themselves. But look at this. Somehow, both teams have found ways to deny each other lines of sight for now. Bubble going down as well. Frag grenade's going to be held, and it will go in, and that's going to be a knock onto AMV. So they're down to just two now. Mooney going to be eliminated, and now it's a 2v2 strike between two brains, one controller, and Elevate. I'm hitting. I hit one on the right. I, hit one on the right. I can barrage this. DTP back. DTP. No, they're still there. It's still there. I cracked him. It's flash. It's Crack, crack on me. Knocked one. Where's Bob? We have a wave of one up, one up. Sure, they have the time to heal. Damage done on the outside of this bubble. However, no, still an opportunity here. Maybe Scissors can't quite finish it, but it doesn't matter because Elevate will capitalize on the situation that was presented to them, and they will take home. Your game number one. And it's just like you said, Onset Elevate playing that from the station, forcing AMV onto that low ground. And I think we both thought, and a lot of viewers probably thought as well, that we were going to see that engagement happen earlier. But it just so happened with the way that the cargo containers were lined up that that battle was just the slightest bit delayed. But you have to think when AMV was forced to bubble early on high ground, it was going to end the way it did. Elevate played it well. They also played slow and composed in the end in that final bubble fight. And they take our game number one.
Let's take a look at the leaderboard. I mean, the cowbells aside, sorry, I've got sidetracked here. The cowbell was just too much for me to, to handle. And uh, I tell you what, for Elevate, they handled everyone in that first one. They were the ones playing the cowbell, Andy. 27 points. Elevate with a 15 kill win off of the break, uh, bringing a lot of points from the lobby to their name. Two brains, one controller, and AMV essentially tied at that second point mark. And then we fall off a little bit to the rest of the lobby. So already starting to see this go one direction. There's no downside to playing with controller on Fortnite either because you can still build just as fast. Yeah. Yeah. Go to the build and you should I'm actually still good at Fortnite. Are you? Are you cracked? Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to build, but I can aim really good. Every time, every time we come out stacked, right? I never use all our meds. Dude, I had I like, like 13 cells left and I had yeah, 20. Yeah, I use like two, maybe like like, four bats max, but I only use, like, two bats. Yeah, I mean, it's just because like, you didn't have anybody looking at us the whole game. Yeah. I mean, it, even yesterday, like, I didn't even use yeah. any meds. Definitely. I always leave this place with 12 cells, and that's not going to happen anymore because I just jinxed myself, but... No, I, there's already, always so many cells here for some reason. Do you want to talk about sword in right now? I can hold two cells, and there's actually two cells somewhere. Do you think that trap will get anybody? Yeah. Nice. I hope they just watch me on stream do that. Good. Looks safe. Say bottom. It always looks safe. Hello? Okay. Oh. Mm -hmm. These guys are not happy that I'm shooting them. Let's see if teams do try and make that rotation as well. Elevate are in a good position, and they look like they have taken residence there. So the winners of our first game in a pretty good spot here in game number two as well. We're going to have to see where that pool occurs in just a few moments. You can see that they've got the uh, the beacon information. So they're uh, currently trying to set up inside. They do have Caustic as well, which is very, very important for denying lines of sight as well as entry points for those four doors that are open and available. So they're in a pretty good spot here, Andy. Game one was very successful, and... If they play this one right, they might have even more points on the board by the time Game 3 arrives. Yeah, certainly. I was even going to say, they're even going to have this option here for the Valk to get out through the top, which is a great, just to get little vantage points, just to get little options there. Could even Skyward Dive, but we've seen some late-game Skyward Dives, and so far the track record for a late Skyward Dive isn't really that high in competitive Apex. We have yet to see it. Okay, we're going to look for it to fight our team to kill us soon. Yeah. We, can we get Look the gun? Look at that. Can we get crane? Isn't this bad? Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm saying. We can, we can land. Crane, let's go, let's go now. Let's go. Crane, come on, like, come on. All the way up on come on. crane. Dinner, yeah. dinner. Like, we can go all the way up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Don't yeah, land yeah. on the second floor because there's going to be a team there. Probably. Um, there's the a team, team there. We can, go, there. we can go above. I'll go all the way up. I'm, I'm doing this. I'm doing this. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I can, I can sneak bomb. Shouldn't the team on higher here? Yeah, I'm shooting the team. I'm supposed to see team higher. Dude, I'm just gonna sit here and not fall off, bro. I don't have any range. Put traps, baby. There's no traps on us. Padding, padding. Fuck out. I'm gonna give you ulti. I'm gonna give you ulti. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I bubbled, sorry. Look, look. You're straight oh, down one. east. Straight down east. You bubbled, you bubbled. Oh, he bubbled. He bubbled. He bubbled. Just one Gibby there. It's two now. Uh, it's two. It's three, 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 three. It's free beans on me, free beans on me. Unable free to pull it me. off for gentrifying. We're gonna have to look to, for uh, G2 to perform in game number three, but all the way on height. It's elevated as we take a look at exactly Valkyrie, how this zone is closing. There's the cube. Once again, Valkyrie showing. How elevation is everything now, and the Spitfire is singing once more. Snipe down has fallen. Imperial How has fallen. And I'm pretty sure you're going to see reps in that kill feed soon as well. He goes down. TSM eliminated. Seven squads now remaining. And Elevate by name. Elevation here by yeah. nature. And you have to wonder how long before that area has a return to game return to uh, boundary listed on it. Uh, pretty high up there in one of the examples of an area that does not have a timer attached to it. So we'll have to see in the, in the Age of Valkyrie how long that sticks around. But right now they're getting away with it as they're going to be able to continue to hold height here as we take a look also at the Renegade side uh, into the late game now with seven squads remaining. They're going to hold low central on that same area. I might have to blend the light pole. 
don't know if it's in. Oh yeah, I know I can do it. Yeah, it's good. It's, I think it's good. I think it's good. I will play late. I will play late. I'll play oh, do we all? I think do we all fly? We all can do it. We all can do it. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I can't get up. So. No, right, I fell down. I fell down. down I fell down. We can we can buckle from here. We have to beam the guy in the roof, I think. We want a buckle? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we all go and light pole. I think so. Or no. I think no. I don't think we can. I don't think we all make that. I think we all like fuck up. Fuck up. Okay, you have cross gold? You have cross You guys go down fight. You guys go down fight. I can I can take the light bulb. Light bulb. Light team here, I think. Team here, oh my god. You have cross gold? Uh... Yeah, I do. Attack! Cross oh, no, 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 no. I'm getting beamed, I'm getting beamed. Look at this roof. Can you cue that? Can you I cued one, I cued one. Fuck, I can't right I'm now. I'm full healing, I'm full healing. He got beamed, he got beamed. I'm cueing it, I'm cueing it. Can you fill up, fill up? Why do you need a drop? Not yet, not yet, not yet. No, we can't. Ready on the I have to take another bat. Flander, Flander, we gotta get ulted. I get another one down here. That's bad, that's bad. Bro, I have to full heal again. I think we just fight the team below us with bubble. And cost the gas. Cost the gas on bubble. We're just throwing traps down. Look, they padded. Okay, play below us, play below us, play below us. I'm with you, I'm with you, I'm with you. I knocked one, I knocked one. We got naded. I give you all the. I, I mean, I, I fucking. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to Bowser is going to have to jump back into that port extremely quickly. He doesn't get in there as the ring will take a victim. And look at this. Elevate. Game one winners. Center zone. And holding the last two teams out in front of them. Of course, the gas is going to go down. Scissors is going to melt one and manage to return to keep himself alive. And this is going to be back to back. It really is that simple here. Where is that last player? He's dead and elevate, go back to back, take game one and follow up with the winning game two. And once again, they make it look way too easy the way that they did that. Like you said, they're going to bubble. They're going to hold center zone. Also, when you bring things like a Spitfire and an EVA 8 to that final bubble, a uh, very low chance that you're going to see a team lose that battle. And that's exactly what they did. They let the other teams play it out. But I have to say, Madness, getting that knock there definitely caused a lot of chaos and it actually forced a lot of those battles to happen maybe slightly earlier than they would have otherwise happened forced teams like you said some teams taking height on that roof other teams dropping low to try to get into that battle but in the end elevate just played spectator watched it all play out they drop from height and they win that game again they go back to back pretty big performance for them elevate once again on their way over to lava city after back to back wins yeah absolutely they're going to look to pick up where they left off not let that momentum get in their way keep in mind they would have had a pretty short route on that first beacon we're going to find out soon where this next one's going so don't worry we'll have to see what kind of route that they might have in store as well as that map is going to be popped up and actually going a little bit further west here and it's not too dissimilar actually to our ring number one that we actually saw in uh, that north thermal ending from elevate yeah, we got it. Set traps. Set traps on us. Yeah. I don't see anyone on the end of the tunnel. Play on like this side of me, by the way. Oh, like, yeah, don't take damage. You see? Get the LOS this. <sighs> I cracked one and I, I'm double flash in there. Oh, Look, this is. Uh, oh. They're fighting so hard in there. I knocked one, I knocked one. Nice. I got the finish. It's G2, it's G2. I, I give you. They knocked one on G2. 10 teams though, I don't want to push this. Yeah, there's, there's two someone else. We got, they just got Gibby. They got Gibby. <clears throat> we clear this one stone closes though, we have to clear that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. They're not in, they're not in. There's no cover here they can play, except for the love. Come on me again. Crack them, crack them again, crack them again. I'm taking a pot, I'm taking a pot. Watch me, watch me. Ready? Watch my right. Put a nade oh, on him. I suck Wraith, I suck Wraith. She's left face. She's one, she's one. She, she has kill this, Mason, kill this, kill this. As Elevate is looking to continue their reign. Look at that oh, cube. The gold armor has just saved him there. The gold armor also saved him being able to pop that cell and get enough HP back into the banks to make sure that that missile swarm wasn't enough to just tick that last bit of HP over. But Gentfine is currently using the care package in every single angle he can find in order to survive here. Elevate once again, Andy, in a great position here towards the end game. And I tell you what, you wouldn't bet against them making this three out of three from the position they found themselves in. You really would not. This is exactly where they want to be. And yeah, they just got to be careful. G2 are constantly looking to press that. And they've got to deal with G. If they deal with G2 very, very quickly in the next few moments, then they might be able to close out this game because you can see on the other side, C9 are very engaged in that respawn building. If C9 had that side of the map to themselves, then Elevate would have a, would have a problem. Now, this looks like the Hail Mary play from G2. They're being forced in by the zone. The bubble has gone down. A little bit of damage has been done. And this is where we'll find out who's going to come out on top. 
I died. I cost a culted. On you? Uh. Fuck. Yeah, that's going to pop up on our map overhead to give all of you at home a bit Oof. of an indication as well. And this. Uh, it looks like it could be a no-name or a geyser zone. So we'll have to see where that pool does go. Maybe a little bit of Fragment East in there as well, although it looks like it's going to be pulling away from that. Maybe that zone that I was mentioning just a yes. few moments ago as well. It does look geyser to me, though. I have to say, I think we'll see a lot of teams maybe move towards geyser. Yeah, I'm not looking better. Could play this, though. This way. No lie. But we can do what we do, like, usually. Yeah, I think we could just play that. We, we don't have... get... We can look, look for one of those buildings, but we don't get it. Oh, I hate this fucking skin. Why are they reskin? Were we able to beat them? Like, if we went a little faster or what? Definitely. Keep that in mind next time, then. Angel is an Octane team. Okay. I think that was Sorting team that took it. Probably, yeah. Your daughter Harvey. Crack, have you over here? They just padded into this building. Can you, can you move this trap? Yeah, I'm coming. They're, fi they're fighting for this building right here. You want me to give you ult it? I think he probably can. I'm gonna give you ult it. I don't need early. Yeah. They're arcing like the sides. Love this one, Is it now? I got it now. I got it. Oh, wait. I think they were just. Oh, no. Never mind. It was just a solo wraith in there. Well, well now they don't have doors, so. Yeah. Alright. You could toss your bub on that ledge. <laughs> yeah. This guy bubbled out for some reason. He's like looking at the skies, I think. Well, I think this guy phased into the. What? He's giving me ammo. He's giving me ammo. <laughs> he gave your arrow back, Mason. What? Your what? arrow. You, you want me to go get it? <laughs> no. Why not? Wait, what? He shot me. He shot me. Okay, he picked yeah, up Mason's arrow and dropped it on the ground. Should I go get it? No, he shot me, man. No, 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 He's baiting, trap. yes. It's it's Maybe he's just being friendly. I can, I can get it, man. No, no, he's not. He just shot Mewson. He's not being friendly. You're so yeah, but dumb. that's different. Why would he shoot me? I'm flying. Shooting above us, I think. Yeah. They, on, 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 on our building, on our building. They're in, they're in. Crack, crack. I'm gonna They're die. so low. Oh, push him, push him, push him. a very intentional one from TSM. We'll have to see how this plays oh. out. But Elevate actually in trouble here as well. Like, guys, yeah, Mewson. Gone down and Scissors is trying to play the back of the bubble. The only problem is he's taking tick damage, and that will be the first game that we've seen Elevate not really perform. Yeah. They will fall in the gas. Anyway, let's move on to the scores. The scores are ready. Let's uh, see who's going to be making it through uh, to tomorrow. Our top 10 teams will be in true game show style. Elevate on top of the pile after their first uh, two games. Back to back win to them. TFSM boosting themselves up to fourth place.